Hey, thanks for joining. So today we're going to talk about, or I'm going to show you our teen room makeover. So our theme was we have a teenager, it's coming out of the kitty stuff, but we kind of still likes Batman. So we want to do a smash up of Batman and City Skyline. Uh, so what we did is we took the basic theme of putting a mirror on the back wall and around the perimeter of the wall we're just going to do some design we have a two-tone wall a darker gray in the bottom a, a lighter gray up top so when we're doing the perimeter around the room we said hey let's do some cool little diagonal designs with the paint and paint some stripes in there um, so my wife was actually putting um, the painter's tape so we decided to alternate with gray and yellow gray and yellow kind of thinking of an urban city um, parking lot stripes kind of uh, thought process there um, so that was pretty fun the, the key is again to really paint over those painters tape uh, with your paint give it some time to dry and, and carefully pull the tape off and you'll have nice crisp sharp lines so that was fun so the mural that was that was cool too so we took a projector projected it on the wall and then took chalk and with the chalk we just outlined the whole silhouette of New York City on that back wall so you can see I'm trying to cover up the light to show you the chalk behind there it's kind of hard to see but once we had chalked out the whole city silhouette back to the painters tape took the painters tape took our time cut it up and then actually follow the outline of the chalk on the wall uh, so once we added all of that then from there we started to paint in the lines to seal in that painters tape and then from there just started painting in this city itself so we just took our time it took a few days to do this part of the project um, and again, it was more so just trying to get all the angles right, um, making sure all the, the painter's tape lined up with the silhouette lines, um, and then just spent the time painting it all in. So this, this, this exercise was pretty fun. Okay, so next what I wanted to do is install a sensory swing for my son to give him a place to relax if he wants to read a book and chill out. Um, so here I'm just measuring um, how far from both sides of the wall I want it. At the same time, figuring out which stud I can drill into. So using a, an eye screw, I uh, found my spot and then just drilled in and installed. It was really easy, really fast and you'll see in a moment after I get it in I'm the first one to jump into it I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna try it out. Daddy! <laughs> I'm trying first. <laughs> so creepy. What's going on in here? It's ready? That fast? I 
mean you're showing me. Dang! I mean you're showing me. That, wait, wait, get out. Huh? Get out. Oh. Dang, that didn't even take no time. I'm gonna be the first kid to get kicked out. Oh. When you start feeling funny. <laughs> when you start acting <laughs> up. <laughs> I love this. So they enjoy that. So here now I'm picking up where I'm just adding some of the artwork for Batman, some Catton artwork of the Batmobile and the Batwing and such, and a poster of uh, Batman on one of the walls. Um, also on the other wall above the closet, we added some uh, train artwork of like uh, New York City, the train symbols, but they spell out certain words like put in the work or do the hustle on stuff like that so they're pretty neat kind of give it a city uh feel um then finally what i did i got some glow in the dark paint from amazon and so i went and filled in the mural with stars i painted the windows in the city so then at night um the mural glows in the dark, or parts of the mural glows in the dark, sort of like giving that city night skyline kind of look. And I'm going to show you what that looks like. So here I'm just filling in randomly some of the windows that's in the in the mural. Okay, here's the big room reveal. So just want to do a quick walkthrough of what you see so far. So this is the sensory swing um, in the ceiling. So he likes that a lot. He gets in there, sometimes he reads a book, um, put his name up in letters. And then that's the big city skyline mural. There's Batman with all his patents. Have some Batman linen, Batman uh, hamper, the uh, subway artwork. So over here, I kind of wanted to show you the mural when it glows in the dark. I bought the black light to charge up the glow in the dark paint because uh, the natural light is not enough to charge it up. So sometimes when you turn on the black light, it'll charge up that paint. And then when you turn off that light, it'll glow. So you can see the certain parts. I put the glow in the dark paint in the windows and other parts I didn't. I kind of wanted to give you a better view of this, so I switched to another camera just to show you how the black light charges up the paint. And it looks pretty nice. Uh, the camera doesn't do it too much justice, so I went and took a picture and did a couple of uh, longer exposures just to show you all the stars and stuff that I had painted in there. And my son loves it a lot. Uh, gets in there with his white noise machine and he relaxes in there. So I hope you like what you saw. I hope I inspired you to give you some ideas to make over your kids' rooms or anything like that. So please subscribe, share, comment, and I'll see you soon. All right. Project done.